Hello everybody, welcome back to Shard and Zeke play Pokemon Soul Silver. Hello. A few things to talk about first. Uh, one, the quality of our voices might sound different. We're trying out different recording setups to try and get rid of some echo. Mm -hmm. Two, my voice might sound shitty. I'm sick. Yeah, Zeke's got a bit of a sore throat going on. I think it's I think it's tonsillitis because it's you know I I looked at my tonsils in the mirror and one of them is huge. Oh dear. Yeah. And the final thing is we lost part of our save. Oh. Oh uh, no. On. Also, that happened. <sighs> Be right back. Bye. Okay, we're back again. Sorry about that. Yeah, like we were saying, um, somehow we lost some of our save data. So um, we had to re-catch the Red Gyarados. We don't have Blue Eyes the Jigglypuff anymore. No. Here he is. Save lost. Save lost. He's not a good boy. Get him out of there. Okay. Move into the bad boy box. No, he's... That's it, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we don't have our Jigglypuff anymore. We're not sure if we're missing anybody else. We don't think we are. No, but the team is the same. Their yeah. levels might just be a little different. Yeah. So, sorry about that. We don't know how it happens, because because it's emulation, sometimes saving is a little tricky. So we usually save states as well. Yeah, we save and we save state, so we've got two backups. Well, we've got one backup. Well, we've got one backup, but two options. Yeah, but either we didn't save state and it fucked up, or we fucked up both. I'm gonna give this to do drop. What is it? The experience share. Oh, okay. Uh, give the shell bell. Oh, to... oh Ian. I, Ian likes healing. I guess okay. everyone likes healing. Yeah, I was gonna say everybody <laughs> likes a bit of heal. Alright, well. Hey, a bit of heal. Yeah, we'll heal. And our next mission is the mahogany warehouse. Yeah. Teaming up with Lance to take down some Batnicks. Batnicks? Yeah. Whoa! Should be a good fun time. Jesus Christ, I hope nobody with an insane voice for me to do shows. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I, I think Silver does show up. Well, do. I think that's okay. As long as it's not like. <gasps> <gasps> Plot! Dragonite Hyperbeam! <laughs> that, that was a tackle. <laughs> <laughs> what took you so long, Cheek? Just as I thought, the strange radio signal is coming from here. From this man. From this. Twitter notification on Charlotte's phone. Twitter, be quiet. I thought I put you on silent. <laughs> the stairs are right here. That's a wardrobe. Man, he is stronger than a strength user. Yeah. Unless it's got wheels. Cheek, we should split up. Check this place. I'm at first. Dragonite, you also go with Cheek. <laughs> <laughs> yes, please. Oh, Ooh. Persian statue. I remember this. Oh, who do you want? So evil. Ah. I was going to say, who do you want to lead with? Oh, well, we're leading with Benedict. It's okay. I can tell. Wee woo, wee woo. Hey, intruder alert. Where? I'll get him. God, this so fast. Sorry, I had to poke the dog. She's still growling at the garden. Oh. No, she's licking her paws. No, me. She hurt her paws a couple of days ago. She got, like, stung when she got a splinter or something. And she keeps licking it and it's just made it worse. We had to put a sock on her the other day. Yeah, she won't be happy with that. Here we go. Whoa! I dragon danced. How do you dragon dance? Metronome. Metronome. Oh, sorry, I was looking at the dog. That's alright. A Zubit. A Zubit. <gasps> oh, we've still got battle animations turned off. Oh, yeah, you can tell we were in a rush <laughs> to get back here. Let's turn them back on after this fight. Okay. Oh, well. Because, yeah, we had to get from before we caught Blue Eye in the Safari Zone to back here, which wasn't as long as I expected it to be. No, it went surprisingly quick as well. Yeah, what? two show up per statue. Oh, I thought it was just one per statue. Nah, two of these pink haired boys show up. They're all with zibbits. Yeah. 
But now I have a dragon band. It probably still would have been the better idea. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yay, look at his animation, it's great. Amazing. We're gonna fly up out. Wow, look at that animation. <laughs> Whoa, look at that one. Whoa! This game's got so many graphics. <sighs> Too many graphics. We had to turn them off. It was <laughs> distracting. <laughs> Grimer. More like Grime. Uh. More like Grimey. More like Frank Grimes from The Simpsons. That man Homer killed. Oh. Is he the one that went insane because like Homer had done so much and he was a lazy layabout and. Yeah, Homer had accidentally done everything. Yeah. Homer's a joke. Yeah. Right. And he called him Grimy. There we go. There we are. We see some sweet battles and jump on our bike. You can't jump on your bike. I can jump on my bike. Right. Right, who needs leveling? Ian needs leveling. Ian does need leveling. Let's let Ian level. Yeah. Benedict absolutely doesn't. No, Benedict is. Go down. Go down? Yeah, the switch to turn the statues off is down, I think. Oh. And that gap to your right. Okay. Intruder alert! It's the same guys every time. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, this will be some cool grinding. I guess, but also it's boring as fuck. <laughs> it's true. See, look, he's that drowsy. He's like, hey -o. Yeah, I'm gonna wash. No, oh, um, it probably doesn't have Dream Eater, is it? Right. Does it have Dream Eater? Let's find out. You wanna find out? Well, we want Ian to wake up eventually, anyway. Oh, that's true. No, I, I was pushing up. Yeah, you can't go up from that one. Yeah. It's really. You have, to, you have to go left then up. It's silly. Yeah, it sucks, man. I agree. Yeah. Emulations are silly. I never noticed that Drowsy has, like, little, uh, boobs. Yeah. What a strange aardvark. <laughs> Do yeah. aardvarks actually have boobs? I don't know. Aardvarks are strange animals. I think I've always seen them as sort of, like, really sharp, sort of, like, claw toenail sort of things. They're, they're like pig trotters, aren't they? They are a bit, yeah. What are you, you creepy it, little boy? Like, my perception of an aardvark is very bored because there's that guy, there's the real ones, and then there's Arthur. He's a fucking bear. No, he's Arthur the aardvark. I don't care what his name <laughs> is. Like, I'm gonna swear Ian's away. From I know, I mark. know people with the surname Green, and you better believe they are the same colour as me. Sweet. Blue. <laughs> but still, after the Aardvark lives in a world of animals where everyone's surname is their species. Yeah, and that's why he's the main character, because he stands out. Oh. Nobody's main character is ever fucking average Joe. <laughs> ex except Doug. Yeah. God, I hate Doug. <laughs> The only good thing about Doug was it had a really good opening theme. Yeah, even that's available. No, it was good. Okay. I mean, Arthur's got a pretty good opening theme. I don't really remember it. And I say, hey, what a wonderful kind of day where we can learn to love and play. It really does sound like the Teletubbies <laughs> or something. Again, again. The tweenies, that's what it reminds oh. me of. Yeah, it is very tweenies like, isn't it? Hey, hey, what you want? Hey, I'm coming with tweenies. Hey, <laughs> but what do you say? Come on, play with tweenies. Nah, <laughs> he, he'd rather die. He'd Who rather can blame die, Zuba. Ooh, Ooh yeah. I shall kill him. Well, yeah. 100%. Garanti if I'm wrong, I will die myself. No. Wait, no, you can die yourself green. 
No. Oh. Wow. Zip it! Oh, I think it's the last one we'll ever record then, I'm sorry. No. Why don't we just be Charlotte and B? Charlotte and X. <laughs> Charlotte and Guest. Just Charlotte Oh, and Ian! X. Ian, you big You had fuck. one job. Uh, I guess... I guess Pippi. No, Pippi. The quick attack it. Yeah. I think Pippi might be a higher level than he was when we were last playing. I think so, yeah. Which is good, because god damn it's for them kind. Gotta protect my Stardo. Stardo. Okay, right. I'm I hope so. I mean, I thought Ian could, but it didn't happen. Yeah. Hey. Hey, Ben. Hey, yo. Set fire to that mud. Oh, yay. Is she like maybe angry at the washing that's hanging out? I don't know. She's sticking her head out of the curtain and going, Ooh. <laughs> I will show them. There's literally nothing in our garden. And like, there's nothing you can see from our garden. Maybe. Yeah. They got big old fence. Maybe we have like a seven foot fence and you are small. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say it's small. Height, small. Height, small. Fence cams everywhere. In case you haven't noticed, they're Persians. Wee. So you faint down here. Down here. Don't go in front of that. So it's just a matter of dodge all the statues, basically. Yeah. Okay. Watch the Secret statue. switch. Ooh. I'll press it. Turn the system is off. I turned it off. This was once a ninja hideout. These traps are to confound intruders, my kid. The giant flashing statues aren't that confusing. I whoa, oh, I didn't expect him to look like that. <laughs> he's unhinged. Oh, he's ready to go. <laughs> Hi guys. Took him out at you. He missed. No. He missed. Hey. And I said, hey. Hey, what a wonderful kind of day. Akamai's pretty rain. Hey. Hey. I like Akamai. <laughs> yeah, Magnemite's alright. More Magnemite. He's all might. <laughs> <laughs> well, there we go. <laughs> and he's dead. Alright. Game's easy. Easy, but save doesn't corrupt itself. Yeah, I'm just glad it didn't go back further. Yeah, right. I'm a little disappointed that the Jigglypuff's gone. Yeah, I thought you would be. But, you know, it's sort of... It's divine intervention now. I decided to not use the Jigglypuff and it, the good lord giveth and the good lord taketh away. Good lord can't stop you from going back and getting another one, though. The good lord giveth and the good lord mildly inconvenient. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's what it is. <laughs> You've got to say it like you've got a lisp, though. <laughs> the good lord mildly inconvenient. Because you've got to get the S at the end. Cool, god spec near the surveillance system. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. You're fucking, uh. Yeah, they're all fine now. You're Quagsire, when he's walking around from the side. He really just. He really does just walk like a guy. Do, 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 do. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's just some guy walking by, <laughs> like a pretty, a pretty rotund do, guy, do, do, but it's just do. some guy. I'm pretty sure some of these are electrode, unless that was only in the originals. I know. That warps you out. Is it? Yeah. Stone oh. train. Train. Voltor! Why did nobody... Did that say a wild Voltor? I think so. Why did nowhere mention the rocket hideout? I don't know. So we could have caught one here. We could have caught one here. You didn't have to trade for one. Whatever. We got Sir Billy. I love Billy. It's such a... There's something about a Pokemon just having a normal-ass fucking <laughs> name that gets me. 
go, Greg. We just fought a Greg. Did we? Yeah. I mean, it must have been in there somewhere. <laughs> the scientist was called Greg. Wow. Man, that's wild how he just got into my subconscious like that. Oh, we will get you. Greg, go and give it to you. Mm, mm, give me that sausage roll. Your Pokemon are hurt and tired. That's good, thank you. <laughs> also, your Quagsire changed into a seal. <laughs> All that happens from time to time. Oh yeah, don't worry about it. It's totally somewhere down here. You think? Seal, it's you... a seal. You gotta move, dude. I guess not. I guess not. What about in the boxes? Hey. hey! Hey, yo! We did it! Ding -de -de -de. The music's creepy here, I like it. Yeah. The door won't open. Well, duh! It has to have a password only Team Rocket knows. Tell me the password. I don't know it. No, you're not a very good Team Rocket. <laughs> oh, Golbat. Oh. oh, look at his face. The mistakes. Do you ever see that picture from, like, I think it's from the show where Golbat has his mouth shut? Yes. <laughs> Put a picture up on the screen, it cracks me up. <laughs> I was playing um, Ultra Moon the other day, and um, I got a photo of a Zubat in the, like, the photo club thing. Mm -hmm. And it's got its mouth shut, and it's, it just looks disappointed. <laughs> just like hmm. oh. do you think we'll lose against this if we keep Ian out uh, maybe oh. Oh. I mean yes if it keeps avoiding but we've dropped its speed enough you know yeah um, really? and Billy will kill it yeah and like if it uses wing attack no problem no problem Got this, you. On zap. Now I know that's electricity, but I always thought that that animation for Charge Beam kind of looks like you're spraying something over him. <laughs> A little bit. <gasps> if it wasn't for like the, the itty bitty lightning bolts in it, it wasn't for them. Yeah. I, I reckon you could like change that to a, like water drops and just call it water gun and have it be tough. Yeah. Heh, I'm just a, yeah. I don't know, too bad for you, you guys. Heh, I'm just a, you know, a, mm, plot. <laughs> Cheek, in order to unlock the door to the radio transmitter, you need the voice of a certain person. Oh. Name of the person is Patrell. They're an executive. I found out he's hiding in their leader's office. Unfortunately, though, that room is also protected with a password. Cheek! We need to find the password of the leader's office first. Alright. You beat this guy, yeah? Oh, the guy in the cape is incredibly handsome and tough and tough. Uh, <laughs> I had no choice but to tell all the secrets about this hideout and my body, but mostly the hideout. -y. Except that our leader's office protected with two passwords. I used to work for Sylph, but now I run research for Team Rocket. Medicine for fighting. Oh, okay. <laughs> Probably if, like, you worked for Sylph and Sylph got taken over, and you were just like, yeah, yeah, I'll convert. Good pay. Maybe. Good holidays. Uh, three year holiday. Wow. Because, you know, they disbanded. <laughs> Coughing has levitated. It has levitated. It has levitated. Wag. Right. Ensuring you. So don't worry, buddy. That's alright, I'll kill you now. You can beat me even without ground moves. Don't worry about <laughs> oh, it. Oh, yeah. See? Check it out. <laughs> I told you, champ, you're doing great. You got this. Who wants a hug? Not me. I haven't got any arms. He wants one, he just can't give you one. <laughs> That's another one. This one will be less reassuring. <laughs> okay. 
Good girl. Oh, you smogging. You were right. Yeah, this this is the sort of one that just blows cigarette smoke in your face. <laughs> oh, you want to fight me? Fine. Yeah. A tactical error cost me. What, the bit where you assured me twice that I could win? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Do you have a password? No. Experiment is a success. This loss means absolutely nothing. Okay. It's true. I took your money though. Do I know the password? Maybe. But no weakling was going to get it. <laughs> Good job, and no weakling. <gasps> hey ya! Team Rocket Grunt. Isn't it weird that we're all called that? <laughs> <laughs> There's no individuality here. <laughs> Hive minds, right? <laughs> Is it just me, or does Atkins get really thick all of a sudden at the top there? He does get pretty thick pretty quick. Like, he looks like he's coiled, but then he's just a chunk. Yeah. Weird. Yes, he's quite chunky. Ooh, he's dead. Fat neck muscles. I mean, he's all neck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's just a head and neck and an asshole. That's a snake. Ooh. Write that in your science books. In my science book. I don't know where it's gone. I think the good lord took us its way. Oh no! Or at least mildly inconvenient. <laughs> well, the good lord needs to pack it in. The good lord needs to check himself before he wrecks himself. I gotta learn me a science about snake buttholes, and he's getting in the way. Do snakes have a cloaca? Maybe. I don't want to Google that. I'll Google it. No, it's alright. I, I can Google it. I don't mind. Next time on Charlotte and Zeke, we'll play more Pokemon. We'll find out if snakes have a cloaca or not. Alright, bye. Bye! <laughs>